A woman is dead after a lawnmower apparently ran over her in a park 90 miles east of San Francisco. The company that owns the park is calling this an accident. A spokesperson for the company says a landscaping contractor couldn't see her since she was lying in a, quote, tall weeded area. Family members of Christine Chavez tell Leanne Denier they believe her death was preventable. The family of 27-year-old Christine Chavez believes her death never should have happened. She was really nice, you know. Now um, she's dead. The Modesto Police Department says Saturday around noon, a Grover employee was cutting the grass at Beard Brook Park on a tractor with a pole behind mower. Police say he noticed a body in the grass that he had already passed through and called 911. She was pronounced dead. We want to try everything, you know, to, to get justice. While the Stanislaus County coroner is still investigating an official cause of death, the family is demanding a thorough investigation by the Modesto Police Department. I know that if you are driving a tractor, you can see even if he, the small uh, rocks, you'll see a, a I mean, uh, one, one person, you will see one person in front of you. It's a lie that, that they didn't see her. And at the Modesto City Council meeting Tuesday... The guy driving the mower did not even bother to ask her to move. He ran right over her. An advocate for homeless people pleaded with the council to look into the incident further. It has to take an advocate to go out there and scream to the world and raise enough awareness and, and get as much media in involved so there is a professional investigation done and it's done right. Des Martinez told us she got a frantic phone call from Chavez's father on Monday and came right to Modesto to try and help. She was a beautiful girl, beautiful young girl. She had a family that loved her. And, and for the trauma that they're going to have to endure for the rest of their lives, this is visions that they will never get out of their head. I keep going because I need to. I, I, I'm looking for justice. And I'm going to be... I'm going to be there, you know, until, until something happens.